And here is another tutorial that completely annoyed me is that when I tried to play Dark Souls 3, specifically with my Razer uh, like controller, it looks like an Xbox controller, but it's made by Razer. Um, and I'm not sure if this applies to other controllers as well, but this is something that fixes the problem of your controller not working in game. And I have no idea why this is a thing, but it's just absolutely ridiculous. So if you plug in your other controller and it just it's not responding in the game menus, this is how you fix it. So you go to oops, you go to devices and printers in control panel. Let's wait for this to load up. And I had to flip and find this by myself because this is like the weirdest fix and I'm not sure if it's specific to me, but if anyone else has this problem, this will help a lot. And then you'll see all these devices and then after tons of time searching on the internet and not finding anything, I noticed that I have two game controllers for some reason. I have no idea where this one comes from. It might be like a default window setting. And then I have this one, which is Xbox 360 gamepad. And literally the, the way you fix this is you just go to this one, you just remove it. And now your controller should work in Dark Souls. And yeah, so if that helps anyone, uh, you're welcome because that really took me a long time to figure out how to do that. Uh, thanks.